Hello and welcome to this HOG4 tutorial which will take a look at the Media Picker. To open the Media Picker, hold down the Open key and press the Media Picker Soft key on the bottom right toolbar. The shortcut for this is PIG, Open and Beam. The Media Picker shows preview images of all slotted values for the currently selected fixtures. The available parameters are shown in tabs down the left hand side. If I select a Solar Spot Pro CMY, then tabs for strobe, colour, gobo and effects wheels are visible. If I select a graphic layer of an Axon Media Server instead, then different tabs such as Object and Media are now shown. There are various buttons along the top of the window to change how the preview images are displayed. You can choose to display or hide the DMX value and also the name of the previews. You can also determine whether the previews are arranged by DMX value or by name. There is also a search box to quickly find suitable content. Sometimes different fixture types may share the same slotted values by name. You can specify whether to show all previews of different fixture types or merge them. When merged, a page turn icon will appear. Previews will be merged if the name is the same, even if the preview image is different. Bringing thumbnail previews into the console from CITP enabled or Catalyst media servers is covered separately in a different tutorial. However, if you are working with a show file created prior to version 2.0.0, you will not immediately see preview thumbnails in the media picker. In this case, open the fixture window, select the fixtures you wish to update from the library and press refresh media. Since version 2.4.0, it became possible to rename thumbnail previews and also add custom images. This might be useful if one or more of your fixtures have been fitted with gobos different from the stock library preview package. In this example, I will just select a single SolarSpot Pro CMY fixture. You can also customise the preview packages of multiple fixtures at the same time if you wish, by selecting them all now. Select the preview you wish to change and press the set key. Type the new name or press the change button to browse the thumbnail library on the console or import a custom image from a USB flash drive. The fixture window displays which preview package each fixture is using. Here we can see that SolarSpot101 is now using the custom preview package. Other fixtures of this same type can also use this custom preview package by selecting the cell, pressing set and selecting the custom preview package from the drop down menu. The customised preview images and names will now be displayed in the slotted toolbar and direct entry menus in the editors as well as in the media picker. In the next tutorial we will look at DMX test and also Artnet merge. Thank you for watching.